All right, what's going on guys? It's GSR here. So basically I wanted to talk to you guys today about um, Gears' broken reset and how you can pretty much beat it. And for people who are new and don't know anything about it, uh, I will pretty much show you guys what it looks like. Keep in mind, I have his crushing blows off. So when I do this, don't be shocked. As you can clearly see, this move shouldn't have come out, but the move still came out for no fucking reason at all. Um, this is the reason why I say this reset is broken, right? But don't get it twisted. You have options of getting out of it. So um, with that being said, let me show you guys what you can actually do. Keep in mind, you are not able to go for your uh, fatal blow, um, but I'm gonna show you guys it anyway, just to show that you can't even go for your fatal blow at all. Uh, so I'm gonna turn on the buttons after this so you guys can see what I'm showing you. Um, all right, so there we go. So now I'm gonna turn on the buttons. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to predict that Gears is gonna go for his reset, right? And when he goes for it, look what happened. I couldn't go for my uh, fatal blow. Now, keep in mind, if you know Gears is gonna do this, you can literally block like this, right? Um, you have an option of doing that. Um, that is definitely in your disposal, right? But another thing you need to keep in mind is that you can flawless block him. So you have an option of punishing him for going for this reset, right? Another thing you need to keep in mind is that if Gears knows for a fact that you're gonna do that, you're trying to flow block his overhead, now you have to watch out from the low, right? So what happens when uh, you decide to block the overhead, right? We're getting ready to find out, right? So he hits you with the reset and then you're like, okay, all right, so I'm just gonna mash my fatal blow. And as you can see, it didn't even come out. The, the fatal blow did not even come out, bro. Like, so it's like, like I'm mashing and it's not even coming out. So what happens if you take it upon yourself to stand up and block? Obviously it's pretty self-explanatory. Um, you'll get hit with the low, which leaves him really close to you. But if he knows for a fact that you're gonna sit there and take it upon yourself um, to block, he can actually dash up and grab you. So you have an option of flawless blocking right there, but if you know for a fact that Gears is going to go for this move, you can just literally block low like that and he'll get punished. Now, I'm not too sure if Sub-Zero's 4-2 is gonna work. Yeah, it's not gonna work. So he can go for something different, which doesn't matter because he gets really good damage anyway. And then I can punish you afterwards and then uh, I can do whatever the fuck I'm trying to do afterwards. You know what I'm saying? So if I know you're gonna go for that shit, the, like the low option, I can punish you just like that. Um, or I can flawless block you, but there's no real reason to do that. So you need to keep in mind that Gears can actually take it upon himself to do this. Um, also, another thing you need to watch out from is that Gears um, can, uh, he can actually throw you if he knows for a fact that you're going to respect and you're gonna block his 50, well, his 50-50 out of that reset. So he can stop just like this and then immediately grab you like this and throw your ass off completely because you thought he was gonna go for that broken ass reset, right? Well, he did go for it, but you thought he was gonna continue with it and then you hold block, right? And then this shit happens to you. So it's a complete mind game and it's kind of trippy. That's why I said his reset was is pretty much broken. Um, you have to be extremely careful. Uh, like extremely fucking careful because you're not in a safe spot. You're, you're really not in a safe spot when he does this to you. You think he's putting you into a combo, but then trying to find out this nigga's over here hitting you with a damn reset uh, that you're not familiar with. So this is pretty much everything in a nutshell. Um, he has an option of backing up and then with punishing you. Um, so actually, let me show you guys that real quick because that's one more thing that I forgot to show you guys. <laughs> uh, so... He could do this and then back up and then possibly go for his crushing blow if he knows for a fact you're gonna mash an uppercut. So you think he's gonna go for the throw, right? And look what happens. <laughs> this shit is broken, but <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, this reset is dumb as hell. And, and people talk about Johnny Cage's reset and how he needs a nerf. At least you have an option. You know what I'm saying? This nigga here, he don't give you shit. He don't give you a fucking thing. You know what I'm saying? And not only that, if you go, if Johnny Cage goes for like his reset, you can flawless block him. If he goes for a throw and you know he's gonna go for a throw, you can uppercut him in his reset. But when it comes to Garris's reset, nigga, it's, it's go big or go home. Like nigga, you, you don't know what's gonna happen. You know what I'm saying? Even though I show you guys this, you don't know what is going to happen to you. You have to be inside the mind of the player if they're being too predictable. But, um, 
I don't really have much to add. I think Gears has definitely the strongest uh, reset in the game um, because this shit is really, really, really intimidating because um, what happens is, is that um, you think he's going to hit you with an overhead, but then he hits you with the low. You think he's going to hit you with the low, but then he hits you with the overhead. You think he's going to hit you with one of those options, so you're preparing yourself for it. And best believe, if you press a button, you're getting hit. But if you think he's going to hit you with a throw, then you try to mash an uppercut, and then that crushing blow comes out. If you think he's going to do any of those, what do you do exactly? You block, because you don't know how to deal with this because it's a complete mind game. And then guess what happens? He can keep throwing your ass every single time because you think that he's going to hit you with that retarded ass 50 50 that he has access to so um i think this is pretty much it not only that he can just go into a full combo punish on you and then possibly get his fatal blowout um he has other options for that but i just wanted to show you guys what you can do against this broken ass reset um because i explained it but i never really showed you what you can actually do um and hopefully this helped you get well it helps you guys out obviously when it comes to sub-zero's reset you can flawless block him but you don't know which one he's going to go for and he could just throw you at the same time so it's like ugh. Uh, but yeah, uh, hopefully this helped you guys out. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.